So today I'm back with a pretty fun video for you guys. About a year ago, I had this trend on my channel where I would take one player, put him into every single position and try to win a World Series. For the first video of that, we did Mike Trout and that ended up getting somewhat like, I think it was 80 something thousand views all put together. Cause I had a part one and a part two and I think both of them got close to 40,000 views, which is something that I was not expecting at all, by the way. So it turns out a bunch of you guys enjoyed it back then and I just never really got back around to it. But today that changes. So I decided for the last couple months of LMB20, we might as well just go ahead and bring back that series and do it a little bit more than what I did before because I really kind of gave up on it after two episodes. Turned out to be really insane. So if you guys have any other player suggestions, go down in the comments and tell me that. Or I have a Google form where you guys can submit any video ideas that you want to so go ahead and fill that out if you guys want to do that as well. But I mean, we can go crazy with this. We can have a full team of Bartolo Colones. We can have a full team of Fernando Tatis Juniors, Juan Sotos, all those type of guys. So, so if you guys want to see that, then be sure to comment that down below. It's going to be the best way to tell me or leave a like on the video. That's also a good way to tell me. So this series future is all in your guys' hands. If you guys want to see more of it, then you got to do those things. But I think that's enough talking. Let's go ahead and finally get into this. And let me show you guys how ridiculous this thing actually is. So on the first opening screen, you guys already see something completely insane. We got Mike Trout as a starter. Now granted, that's not the real Mike Trout because only the show will not let me edit his actual player. If I wanted to take the actual Mike Trout, I can change pretty much any position on him, but I just can't change him to be a pitcher. So that's the one thing that kind of sucks about this is I can't really, hold on, why the heck is he on waivers? Game, are you absolutely insane? What are we doing here? Out of all the fake Mike Trouts on this team, why the heck do they have the real Mike Trout? on waivers. What's going on? I'll have to fix that real quick, but what the heck is this thing on? So as you guys can tell from these Mike Trouts, I got these from the player vaults. Again, sadly, just can't copy and paste the real ones. So all these guys are from the player vaults. I still think it's gonna be pretty fun though, just because of how crazy this thing actually is. I just kind of wish the people that made the starting pitching Mike Trouts just kind of tried a little bit harder on the face, but what are you gonna do? 569 seconds later. I ended up taking a little bit of time and put Mike Trout in every single position, but this thing just looks insane. Like, could you imagine Mike Trout, the guy's 6'2", 235 pounds at third base, or second base. Could you imagine just a built freaking dude like Mike Trout playing one of those type of positions? That'd just be insane. Not to mention, we're gonna have an entire pitching staff of Mike Trout, so it's gonna get even weirder. This whole video is about to be nuts. I hope you guys do enjoy it. Oh my God, though, just seeing an entire offense of Mike Trout just is insane to me. If I was any of these Mike Trouts, though, I would love to be either the center fielder Mike Trout or the DH, to be honest, because those guys probably have the easiest jobs. Just because the DH, all he's gotta do is hit, and then the center fielder, I mean, that's Mike Trout. He's already in center field. He's got it. But like the catching Mike Trout, that's gonna be a little bit more difficult, but I don't know. Either way, let's go ahead and get this thing going. Again, we gotta win a World Series. I would assume it's gonna be somewhat easy. Again, we got a full team of 99, so I'm gonna go for a dynasty pretty much. I think that's only fair if we kind of go for a dynasty just because of how glitched out this team actually is. But I mean, hey, we'll see what happens. We might end up not doing that great. Again, LB20, they're pretty insane, so you really have no clue. Also, I gotta point this out. Look at the freaking budget, dude. Oh no. <laughs> I need someone in the comments right now to tell me who the heck's the owner of the Angels because I feel so bad for that man. For the next 10 years, we have a player's salary of over $400 million. That man's gotta pay. Just in the freaking player salaries. Oh my God. Tickets are about to be $350,000 a piece. Either way, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing going. Let's go ahead and send to draft day and let's see how good we're doing. I mean, again, I really have no clue. I'm only assuming that we're gonna do good just based off the fact that we got all 99s, but this game's kind of nuts, so I don't know. We went a little bit past draft day and it turns out we had a little bit of a rocky start, but we kind of picked it up towards the end of April and now we're 74 and 13, so there we go. Turns out that if you have a full team of Mike Trouts, you do great, who would have thought, you know? And now we're actually here at the Home Run Derby and I gotta check something real quick. I wanna see if it's just all us. That would be absolutely hilarious if it's just nothing but Mike Mike Trout in the Home Run Derby. Let's take a look real quick. Let's see. We got four Mike Trouts. Oh my God, though. So every single person from the AL side of the Home Run Derby is just us. Every single one. We got all the Mike Trouts. They got 42 home runs, 40, 39, and 36. I feel so bad for Freeman, Bad Suarez, and Ozuna. You guys are about to die. I'm just gonna go ahead and assume that one of the Mike Trouts won the Home Run Derby. Let's take a look at this All-Star game now. I gotta check this out. I'm gonna assume that we have at least 11 All-Stars on this team. Just straight up. I'm gonna assume it's 11. Let's see, from the AL side, we got... It doesn't look like a single Mike Trout made it in with the actual rotation. So that's a little bit of a uh, bad sign. But let's see if we actually made it in with the lineup. Let's take a look. And there you go. Oh. oh my God. And I will say I was wrong about something. I thought that we were going to have 11 Mike Trouts in this team. Turns out we only have eight. So yeah, the fact that I'm saying that we only have eight players on one all-star team is just stupid, but hey, let's just go. Let's get this thing going. I want to see all these Mike Trouts just destroy you, Darvish. Let's go, boys. Come on. What are we doing here? Let's just pop off real quick. Come on. And we're actually losing. Hold on a minute. Wait a second. Guys, we have a full team of Mike Trouts. Let's not lose this, all right? Come on. Oh my God, we're actually losing by a whole lot. Come on, boys. There we go, Mike Trout, bringing it back. Which one? The left fielder. Okay, good. I legit like need a nickname for each one because there's so freaking many of them. 
The right field Mike Trout. Thank you for the two-run bomb. There are so many Mike Trouts. Oh my goodness. And we ended up taking the game. Who would have thought? Either way, let's go ahead and blow past that. Let's go to the tread headline. Again, we're not going to be able to do anything just because we want to keep the team the exact same. But I just got to check around the league on how everybody's doing. All right, real quick, who's the best team right now besides us? It looks like it's the Padres right now. Wow. And the Mets. Okay, the Mets right now are doing a little bit better than the Padres. If we take a look, they're 70 and 38, and they only have 554 runs scored, right? If we go over to us right now, we almost have 1,000. We're one run off of 1,000 runs scored. I mean, we pretty much almost doubled them, which is disgusting. I'd say Bubba the Clown. Okay, Rob Manfred is probably piss testing us every single game. And to be honest, I don't blame him. With the amount of talent on this team, it makes sense. I'd piss test us every single day too. I mean, my God, let's just go and get to the second half and win this World Series. Let's go, baby. 569 seconds later. Already in the first week of September, we have 14 more Ws than the 2001 Mariners. So we've blown past that record. Let's go, dude. Let's keep it going. Let's finish off above 140. I think we could do it. Let's see. And there we go, 142 and 20. Oh my God. I gotta check this pitching stuff because I know it's on fire. Let's take a look. Oh my God. I mean, these are juiced up Roger Clemens numbers. You know what I'm saying? Like this is insane. The first Mike Trout, 25 and seven with 290 innings pitch, 354 strikeouts with a 2.95 with a 1.13 whip. Like, was there any person that broke 300 innings? Okay, it turns out that's not the case, but still that's insane. Below him, we have someone that went 32 and 0. Oh my God. The guy straight up did not lose a single outing. Oh my God, that's insane. The man went 32 and 0, 296 innings, 360 strikeouts, with a 1.82 and a 0.93 whip. This is the Cy Young. Honestly, just lock it in. For real. That was easy. 100%. Like, what the heck? The next Mike Trout, 29-3, 284 innings, 345 strikeouts with a 2.5 ERA. The fourth Mike Trout, 27-5, 281 innings pitched, 331 strikeouts with a 3.32. And then the last Mike Trout, 27-5, 282 innings pitched, 355 strikeouts with a 2.13 ERA. Did the relievers even do anything? Let's take a look. Oh my God, not a single one played. Legitimately not a single reliever played one inning. Not even one reliever got one out this entire regular season. That's actually disgusting. Oh my God. Let's go ahead and check these awards real quick. Let's take it. We have six awards that we got to go through. Okay, here we go. The Silver Slugger going to the second base Mike Trout. The American League MVP going to one of our starters. We have the AL Rookie of the Year going to one of our starters. We have the Hank Aaron Award going to our second baseman. We have the Gold Glove Award going to one of our starters. And the last one, Sign Award going to one of our starters. Of course. I mean, it makes sense. The guy that went 32-0 with a 1.82 with 360 strikeouts. I mean, what the heck? This guy for sure is on something. Man's honestly on all the steroids, not to mention this Mike Trout. 347 with 58 home runs and 174 RBIs. Look at the pages and pages and pages of the MLB League leaders. We got two full pages of it. And you see those three dots on the end? That means there's a lot more to that. They just can't show it. This team went off to the max and we're still losing $5 million a week. That hurts so much. But also think about it. Imagine losing $5 million a week with a full team of Mike Trouts. I mean, I don't care if the tickets are $1,000 a piece. I'm still buying one because I want to see this team play. All right, I think it's time to just crush some people's dreams real quick. Let's go ahead and get into this postseason. First up, Houston. This is going to be so great. Oh my God. Oh my God. Thank you, baseball guys, for letting this happen. Here we go. Mike Trout versus Justin Verlander. Real quick, got to point it out. I like Justin Verlander, okay? I don't think any of this crap is his fault. I just think my dude Justin Verlander got thrown into a crappy situation, so I don't want to see any Justin Verlander slander on my watch, all right? And with that, Verlander, I'm sorry, but we got to kill you. So there we go. Yeah, goodbye. Next up, Granky. I think the same with him. He probably came in a little bit late, probably couldn't do anything about it, so you can't really call it the clubhouse when you're the new guy there. Either way, again, Granky, I like you, but sorry, my dude. There we go. Game three, Mike Trout versus Framber. Framber, I have no freaking clue who the heck you are, but I'm sorry. Right, there we go. Goodbye. And now we get to face the Yankees. Oh my God, this just keeps getting sweeter. All right, I'm down. Let's go. As a Rays fan, I'm just happy that the Rays didn't make it this far because I would hate to smack my own team with this team right now. So let's get it going. Mike Trout versus Luis Severino. Goodbye. Game two, Mike Trout versus Chad Green. Oh, you poor guy. There we go. Goodbye. Just everybody wave goodbye. Game three, Mike Trout versus James Paxson. Out of all the pitchers on the Yankees team, I did not think James Paxson was going to take us down. I got to respect it. Honestly, round of applause for James Paxson actually keeping us down. My God. All right, game four, Mike Trout versus Luis Severino. 
There we are. Back to business. And then game five, Mike Trout versus Devi Garcia. The poor rookie, dude. Don't do this to him. Oh, no. Goodbye. Now we're facing the Dodgers. This just keeps getting better and better and better. All right, here we go. LA versus LA. But I'd got to say, Anaheim side looks a little bit more insane. Okay, let's go. Game one, looks like we're taking that one by a hefty margin. Poor Walker Bueller. Game two, Mike Trout versus Clayton Kershaw. Again, poor Clayton Kershaw. Game three, Mike Trout versus Tony Goslin. I mean, this poor guy, too. There you go. Goodbye. And for this last one, I think we got to play it just because I got to see how insane this thing looks. Let's go ahead and play a lock as one of them. I'm thinking we go second base because apparently the second baseman is the most insane out of all these guys. So let's play a lock as him and let's go into this game. Oh, this is just mean. Look at the series recap. 12 to 2, 5 to 3, and then 10 to 3. Come on. What are you doing? Don't let the poor Dodgers fans know real quick. And we got Walker Bueller going up. My guy, I'm so sorry. I feel bad. Actually, nah. Let's go. Here we are, boys. Look how beefy this dude straight up looks. Oh, my God. Real quick, let me change the camera from strike zone. Let me actually get a good look on this. Let's go. It will be 15. Let's go and be 15. Why not? Here we go. Now you got to give me a little bit of time because it's been a while since I actually played this game. I do a lot of franchise. I don't actually play Diamond Dynasty or anything like that. So give me a little bit of time. Let me get that LB19 RGS back up here. Let's go. There we are. Okay, that better drop. That's not going to drop, is it? Yeah, of course. Okay, never mind. It's going to take a little bit, all right? Just got to give me a little bit of time. All right, here we go. New opportunity. It's still two to nothing. Also, I got to change something real quick. I got to change the color of my PC out of something else because it's completely blending in with my dude Walker Bueller. So let's get green or something nuts. There we go. It's a lot better. I can actually see it. And what do you know? Look at that. Mike Trout just straight up golfed this thing out of here. Pick it out of the Pacific Ocean. My God. Look at that. Giving us the throwing lead. My dude, Mike Trout, just completely Tiger Woods is this thing out of here. Oh, okay. We're back in the field. Let's go, baby. All right, here we go. Look how weird this is. Just all Mike Trout's in one freaking infield. Come on, boys. There we are. Perfect. Beautiful. Routine, baby. Next appearance, we got two guys in scoring position right now versus Dustin May. Dustin, my apologies, my dude. This guy's a rookie right now. We're doing this to him. Come on. I think I'm going to power swing this one because why not? Oh, that was it. That was it right there. I just freaking missed it because I suck. I still think I got to power swing this one. I mean, come on. It's got to be done. Let's real quick hit this one to Japan. Oh, my God. There it goes. Yo, Tokyo, look out. My God, 460. Jesus. Let's go into the next appearance, and my god, it's 10 nothing. I know that we gave our team the three run lead, but what happened? I mean, this just isn't even fair anymore. Come on. That's beautiful, too. Oh, that's gonna hang up, though? No, it's not. Wow, okay, we got the single. Let's go, baby. And you best believe with this gargantuan of a human being, I'm still in third. Let's go. Come on. Never mind. Get back. Mookie's about to get that real quick and fire this thing in. Get back, boys. There we are. We also have one more opportunity to hit. Oh, my goodness. I mean, I don't really have any other targets to hit. Oh, well, I guess center field's fine too. Okay, I was gonna say, I don't have any other targets hit with home runs. I hit the Pacific Ocean, I hit Japan. I mean, there's really nothing else that I could hit. There's just a lot of other small islands in the Pacific. And here we go, bottom nine, we got one out. Let's try to see if we could double these guys off. That'd be perfect. If I could somehow double them off. Okay, that's not gonna happen. All right, let's just get the two outs, get the easy out real quick. And we're one out away from the World Series right now. And it's gotta happen. There we go, look at that, dude. Joe Madden, let's get it, baby. We're back. Another ring in the bag and all the Mike Trouts just go ahead and swarm each other. Let's go, baby. Also, look at the forearms. I'm sorry, but what the heck? Trout, why are you so huge, my guy? Like, legit, why are you so massive? Like, you just gotta respect it, my God. Either way, 2020 World Champs, let's go. Let's run it back again, let's try to go back to back. Real quick though, let's take a look at the awards. We got the second base Mike Trout winning postseason MVP, and the World Series MVP goes to the second base Mike Trout. For some reason, the second base Mike Trout is too insane. Give me his jersey straight up. I'll rep it too. 569 seconds later. Oh, don't tell me. Oh my God. We had one Mike Trout that I actually had to re-sign back. And the man didn't want a max term contract. He decided to sign for nine years with the Cubs. This freaking traitor over here, dude. I mean, we still got 25 others, but what the heck? I got to play with one man down this season. Like straight up, what a little rat. Come on. What are we doing here? You're supposed to stay with me. We're supposed to win back to back. I don't think you're going to win back to back with the Cubs. Okay, hate to tell you. Either way, the team's still the exact same. This should be pretty fun. Let's go ahead and win this World Series once again in 2021. And if we do that, I'm pretty sure that just solidifies us as the greatest team of all time. So let's go ahead and get it done real quick. All right, here we are, July 11th of 2021, and we're 84 and 12. I mean, come on. It doesn't really get much better than that. If we look at everybody real quick, we got just Mike Trout's. doing so good. If I look real quick, it looks like the best Mike Trout is actually our shortstop this time around. He's got 38 home runs, 91 RBIs, and a 350. It honestly just doesn't get much better than that. I don't know what else to say. It really just doesn't. 
real quick before we go ahead and go into the second half of the season, I do want to see if any pitcher in the bullpen has pitched an inning, like at least one inning. I got to check it. Let's see. Has anyone pitched at least one inning? I have a feeling it's going to be the first guy. He's pitched 99 innings. Okay. Alrighty. Yeah. But to be honest, I think one of them was injured. I think this Mike Trout was actually injured because he only has 80 innings compared to others they have 181. So if we do the math, about 100 innings plus 80, it looks like they ended up splitting time in the rotation. So I would consider this guy more of a starter than an actual bullpen piece, but yeah, it still looks like the bullpen did absolutely nothing so far. So that's so crazy for me to see because I'm just so used to building a good bullpen in other videos. And then I see this and we're not even using our entire bullpen. Our starters are just putting all these games on their back and they're winning us like 120 plus games. It's insane. Either way, let's go ahead and keep this thing going real quick. Gotta check it. I'm sure that there's going to be quite a few Mike Trouts here. What do you know? Everybody from the AL is Mike Trout. So there you are. And I do want to check this one last All-Star game because I feel like there's got to be at least one pitcher from our team that's on this All-Star team. Come on. I mean, it's a little bit unfair if they're not. And there we go. We got one finally. It's our reliever that ended up pitching a bunch of innings. But how come none of the other starters have actually made it in? It's Dallas Keuchel, Marco Gonzalez, John Means, Frankie. But there's not a single one of our Mike Trout starters that have made it to the All-Star game. That doesn't really make all that much sense. So I don't know about that one. And then we got over six Mike Trouts in the batting order. I mean, my God. Let's get this game going. And Mike Trout's actually giving up some runs. What the heck is going on, boys? But there we go. Scored two. Make that three real quick. Make that four real quick came back quite a bit yeah it looks like the game's about to be done looks like we just completely destroyed the nl once again would you look at that mike trout player of the game two home runs four rbis man gets a car let's get it baby w let's keep going to the second half of the season i'll see you guys there and let's just win this world series again i mean come on let's just do it last year we finished off 142 and 20 let's try to beat that this year come on guys come on come on did we beat it we beat it let's go by three games we won three more this year and beat last year's record let's go baby almost 900 by the way on the win percentage what the heck real quick of course gotta check the awards look at that we got five this time the silver slugger going to the relief pitching mike trout huh straight up what that's insane going to the relief pitcher i, I gotta be reading that wrong do i have glasses over here no straight up i don't there's glasses back there but i'm not gonna get up the relief pitching Mike Trout. Okay. MVP going to the starter once again. Hank Aaron Ward going to the relief pitcher again. Dude, what is happening right now? He beat out the guy that hit 66 home runs. He didn't have a single plate appearance. And he got the award for the highest batting average in the entire league. I mean, hello? Am I missing something? Like, what's going on? I feel like I'm completely just tripping right now. A point zero 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 for average, zero home runs, and zero RBIs wins you the batting title. Okay, let's keep it moving. Also won the Hank Aaron Award without getting a single hit in the entire MLB. Okay, that's great, dude. What the heck is going on? Okay, I really don't know how to react. Let's just go ahead and get to the postseason. Oh my god. Versus Cleveland right now for the ALDS. This is about to be so sad. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. Yeah, they're gone. ALCS time. The Twins. Again, I'm so sorry, guys. Come on. Yeah, there we are. Goodbye. And now the World Series. It's either going to be the Padres or the Braves. Please don't let it be the Padres because I actually want them to win a World Series. And it's Atlanta. Thank God. Alrighty, here we are. Game one. Mike Trout versus Sean Newcomb. I don't know why they're pitching Sean Newcomb first. He got destroyed. Game Game two, Mike Trout versus Max Freed. Again, Max Freed probably gonna get destroyed. My apologies, my guy. Game three, Mike Trout versus Sean Manea. Again, I am so sorry. Won that one 20 to three. Oh my God. And then the last game, game four, we're going up against Michael Fulmer. I'm going ahead back into this. I want to play one last game of it. You know, let's go with the first baseman. Why not? Let's go with him. Oh no. And we're playing in Atlanta. Come on. This is just going to be too mean. And I think for the PCI this time, do they have like a magenta? They do. Okay. Wow. Perfect. Let's go with that. Cause I'm going to be able to see that a whole lot better than anything else. So let's go baby. Come on. Somehow it's one to one in the top of the second. Let's just go ahead and bust this lead wide open on poor Michael Fulmer. And he actually got me with that one. Okay, that was bad. All right, coming in right now, it's five to three. This poor guy, Michael Fulmer, beat it out. He's not gonna beat it out. Oh God, we're not doing good so far. The first base of Mike Trout, I just gotta relax with him or something because I am not having it right now with this man. Me and the second baseman were grooving. We were straight up vibing. But for some reason, the first baseman, it ain't working right now with me. So come on, there we go. Nice pick, let's get it. Let's go back in a hit and let's actually try to get something together. It's nine to three right now in the top of the sixth. I wanna contribute just a little bit, so come on. Let's go ahead and get something together. Come on, I'm going for garbage pitches. Oh my God, I saw Suck. I have no clue why I went for that pitch. I let off two straight balls and then went for that garbage outside the zone. My goodness. I was sure I'm doing good before. I don't know what happened to me. There we go. They just got to put meatballs in the middle of the plate. And are you kidding me? Acuna Jr., dude. Really? 
Never mind, that's Ozuna. But still. Ozuna, are you kidding me, my guy? You're gonna lay out like that on me? Oh my goodness. That's probably the last attempt we got to hit. That was such a stinker. Those appearances just straight up sucked for me. Oh my god. I'm taking this myself. Get away from me, pitcher. Please, give me one more attempt to hit. Come on. Guys, bat around. Just bat around a little bit more. Walk, that's perfect. A double, that's perfect. God dang it. All right, well, it's looking like that's gonna be it. We're still gonna win this World Series, which is insane, but Freddie Freeman, that's a ball straight down the line. We get there, perfect. Okay, take it ourselves, and that's gonna be it, pretty much. We are one out away from the World Series once again, two straight years in a row, and there we are. Perfect, we did it. Madden, run it back, baby. Get the hugs going, all the Mike Trouts, get going, boys. We did it once again, let's go. That was actually a really fun, more chill video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you guys did, again, leave a like on it. That's gonna be the best way to tell me. If you guys do enjoy videos like this, besides just normal rebuilds and challenges, if you guys wanna see more videos like this with Fernando Tatis Jr., Juan Soto, Ronald Acuna Jr., we were just on the Braves, so then be sure to either tell me that down in the comments or leave a like on this video right now. If you guys haven't, subscribe to the channel. I'd really appreciate that too. Also hit that bell notification so you guys will be notified every time I upload. And besides. Besides that, we just got to check out the awards, and that is going to be it. Playoff MVP goes to the center field Mike Trout, and then the World Series MVP goes to the third base Mike Trout. Let's go, boys. That's going to be it for me. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Stay safe, and peace out.